In this problem, we have to solve this nonlinear system of equations. And the best way to do it is probably going to be substitution because the second equation has already been solved for y. So we can just take this and plug it into the first equation. So this is x plus, and then replace y with x squared minus 6x plus 9, and that's equal to 3. All right, so now we can um, combine like terms. So we have x squared. Uh, 1x minus 6x will be minus 5x. We have plus 9 equals 3. Let's go ahead and subtract the 3 so we can try to factor this. So we have x squared minus 5x plus 6, and that's equal to 0. So this should factor, let's go ahead and try. It's gonna probably look like this, parentheses x, parentheses x, equal to zero. So we need two numbers that multiply to six and add to negative five. I think uh, two and three should do it. Two times three is six, and if we make them both negative, they'll both add to negative five. Negative three plus negative two is negative five. So you set each piece equal to zero and you end up getting two possible x values. So now what we do is we take these x values and we plug them in to uh, our equation. So I'm gonna write them again up here. x equals three, x equals two. And you can use either of these. Uh, I'm going to use uh, this one. I'm gonna solve this one, or let's just, let's just plug it in. So when x is three, you have to do each one individually because the final answer is an ordered pair. So it's really key that uh, you do one at a time. So instead of x, it'll be three plus y equals three. Then subtract three, and that will give us y equals zero. So when x is equal to three, y is equal to zero. So that gives us our first ordered pair. So three comma zero, that is one of the solutions. Let's do the next one. So when x is equal to two, we plug in two, so we get two plus y equals three. So subtracting two, subtracting two, we get y equals one. So when x is two, y is one, that gives us the next ordered pair, so two comma one. So both of these would be solutions to the system of equations.